Hello, my name is Manzal Parikh and I did my B.Tech in Civil Engineering from the Navarachna University from 2015 to 2019 and my experience of this four years with the university has been incredible. The university's curriculum is such that the student is not only taught the subjects from their own branch so that the student comes out as an old engineer and is capable to face the real world at the end of four years. The civil engineering's curriculum includes all the subjects of structure, environmental, planning, management, geotech, and many more. Each subject has both theory as well as the practical sessions. The civil engineering department has well equipped laboratories right from fluid mechanics, design studio, construction technology, and many more where all the theories taught in the classroom come into visual. Site visits have also been part of the curriculum where the students visit ongoing construction sites, RMC plant, water treatment plant and many more where the students can practically visualize the ongoing field and the life of an engineer. The non-technical subjects like soft skill, entrepreneurship, communication and the interdisciplinary courses are a part of our curriculum which shapes us for the corporate world at the end of four years. The last two years of BTEC include the research project where we can experiment through the various fields of our branch and create something new. The university has its own tech fest called the Innovate where each department has its own event and workshops where we can sharpen and even show off our skills. The university hosts many workshops, seminars and international conferences where the student get a platform to present their research papers in front of diverse industrial experts. To maintain all of this with my good academics and performing consistently well would not have been possible without my faculty. The university has well qualified and well experienced faculties. Without the support and the freedom given to me by the faculty and the management of the university, this would not have been possible. A big thank you to the Navarachna University.